In physics, the angular velocity of a particle is the rate at which it rotates around a chosen center point, that is, the time rate of change of its angular displacement relative to the origin i.e. in layman's terms, how quickly an object goes around something over a period of time, e.g. how fast the Earth orbits the Sun. It is measured in angle per unit time, radians per second in SI units, and is usually represented by the symbol omega, omega, sometimes omega. By convention, positive angular velocity indicates counter-clockwise rotation, while negative is clockwise. For example, a geostationary satellite completes one orbit per day above the equator, or 360 degrees per 24 hours, and has angular velocity omega. Topic: 15 degrees per hour, or 2 pi, 24 approximately equals 0.26 radians per hour. If angle is measured in radians, the linear velocity is the radius times the angular velocity v equals r omega display style v equals r omega with orbital radius 42,000 km from the Earth's center, the satellite's speed through space is thus v equals 42,000 times 0.26 approximately equals 11,000 km per hour. The angular velocity is positive since the satellite travels eastward with the Earth's rotation counterclockwise from above the North Pole. In three dimensions, angular velocity is a pseudovector, with its magnitude measuring the rate of rotation, and its direction pointing along the axis of rotation perpendicular to the radius and velocity vectors. The up or down orientation of angular velocity is conventionally specified by the right-hand rule. <laughs> angular velocity of a particle Particle in two dimensions In the simplest case of circular motion at radius r, with position given by the angular displacement phi t from the x-axis, the angular velocity is the rate of change of angle with respect to time omega equals d phi d T display style omega equals t f r a c d phi d t. If phi display style phi is measured in radians, the distance from the x-axis around the circle to the particle is equals r phi display style l equals r phi, and the linear velocity is v t equals D D T equals R Omega T Display style V T equals T F R A C D L D T equals R Omega T So that Omega equals V R Display style Omega equals T F R A C V R in the general case of a particle moving in the plane, the angular velocity is measured relative to a chosen center point, called the origin. The diagram shows the radius vector r from the origin o to the particle p, with its polar coordinates r phi r phi. All variables are functions of time t. The particle has linear velocity splitting as v equals v plus v display style math bf v equals math bf v underscore plus math bf v underscore perp with the radial component v display style math bf v underscore parallel to the radius and the cross radial or tangential or circular component v display style math bf v underscore perp perpendicular to the radius. When there is no radial component, the particle moves around the origin in a circle, but when there is no cross-radial component, it moves in a straight line from the origin. 
Since radial motion leaves the angle unchanged, only the cross-radial component of linear velocity contributes to angular velocity. The angular velocity ω is the rate of change of angle with respect to time, which can be computed from the cross-radial velocity as ω equals d phi d t equals v r display style omega equals frac d phi dt equals frac v underscore perp r here the cross radial speed v display style v underscore perp is the signed magnitude of v display style math bf v underscore perp positive for counterclockwise motion negative for clockwise Taking polar coordinates for the linear velocity v gives magnitude v linear speed and angle theta relative to the radius vector. In these terms, v equals v sin theta. Display style v underscore perp equals v sin theta. So that omega equals v sin theta r. Display style omega equals frac v sin theta r. These formulas may be derived from r equals x t y t. Display style math bf r equals x t y t v equals x t y t display style math bf v equals x t y t and phi equals arctan y t x t display style phi equals arctan y t x t together with the projection formula v equals r r v display style v underscore perp equals tfrac math bf r caret perp r c d o t math bf v where r equals minus y x display style math bf r caret perp equals y x in two dimensions, angular velocity is a number with plus or minus sign indicating orientation, but not pointing in a direction. The sign is conventionally taken to be positive if the radius vector turns counterclockwise, and negative if clockwise. Angular velocity may be termed a pseudoscalar, a numerical quantity which changes sign under a parity inversion, such as inverting one axis or switching the two axes. Topic. Particle in three dimensions In three-dimensional space, we again have the position vector r of a moving particle, its radius vector from the origin. Angular velocity is a vector, or pseudovector whose magnitude measures the rate at which the radius sweeps out angle, and whose direction shows the principal axis of rotation. Its up or down direction is given by the right-hand rule. Let the axial vector u Display style math bf u be the unit length vector perpendicular to the plane of rotation spanned by the radius and velocity vectors, so that the direction of rotation is counterclockwise, looking from the top of u. Display style math bf u. Taking polar coordinates r phi. Display style r phi. In the plane of rotation, as in the two-dimensional case above, one may define the angular velocity vector as omega equals omega u equals d phi d t u equals v sin theta r u. Display style bold symbol omega equals omega math bf u equals tfrac d phi dt math bf u equals frac v sin theta r math bf u. 
where θ is the angle between r and v. In terms of the cross product, this is omega equals r times v r two. Display style bold symbol omega equals frac math bfr times math bf v r caret two. From this, one can recover the tangential velocity as v equals omega times r. Display style math bf v underscore perp equals bold symbol omega times math bf r. Topic. Addition of angular velocity vectors If a point rotates with angular velocity omega 1 display style omega underscore 1 in a coordinate frame f 1 display style f underscore 1 which itself rotates with an angular velocity omega 2 Display style omega underscore two with respect to an external frame f two display style f underscore two we can define omega one plus omega two display style omega underscore one plus omega underscore two to be the composite angular velocity vector of the point with respect to f 2 display style f underscore 2 this operation coincides with usual addition of vectors and it gives angular velocity the algebraic structure of a true vector rather than just a pseudo vector the only non obvious property of the above addition is commutativity this can be proven from the fact that the velocity tensor w c below is skew symmetric so that r equals e W T display style R equals E caret W T is a rotation matrix which can be expanded as R equals I plus W D T plus one two W D T two Plus display style r equals i plus w c d o t d t plus t f r a c one two w c d o t d t caret two plus l dots. The composition of rotations is not commutative, but i plus w one d t i plus w two D T equals I plus W two D T I plus W one D T Display style I plus W underscore one C D O T D T I plus W underscore two C D O T D T equals I plus W underscore two C D O T D T I plus W underscore one C D O T D T is commutative to first order, and therefore Omega one plus Omega two equals Omega two plus omega 1 display style omega underscore 1 plus omega underscore 2 equals omega underscore 2 plus omega underscore 1 notice that this also defines the subtraction as the addition of a negative vector topic angular velocity vector for a frame Given a rotating frame of three unit coordinate vectors, all the three must have the same angular speed at each instant. In such a frame, each vector may be considered as a moving particle with constant scalar radius. The rotating frame appears in the context of rigid bodies, and special tools have been developed for it. The angular velocity may be described as a vector or equivalently as a tensor. 
Consistent with the general definition, the angular velocity of a frame is defined as the angular velocity of any of the three vectors same for all. The addition of angular velocity vectors for frames is also defined by the usual vector addition composition of linear movements, and can be useful to decompose the rotation as in a gimbal. Components of the vector can be calculated as derivatives of the parameters defining the moving frames Euler angles or rotation matrices. As in the general case, addition is commutative omega 1 plus omega 2 equals omega 2 plus omega 1 display style omega underscore 1 plus omega underscore 2 equals omega underscore 2 plus omega underscore 1 by Euler's rotation theorem, any rotating frame possesses an instantaneous axis of rotation, which is the direction of the angular velocity vector, and the magnitude of the angular velocity is consistent with the two-dimensional case. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Components from the vectors of the frame. Considering a coordinate vector of the frame as a particle r equals e i display style math bf r equals math bf e underscore i with e i equals 1 display style math bf e underscore i equals 1 we obtain the angular velocity vector omega equals r times V R two equals E one times E one equals E two times E two equals E three times E three Display style bold symbol omega equals frac math bf r times math bf v r caret two equals math bf e underscore one times dot math bf e underscore one equals math bf e underscore two times dot math bf e underscore two equals math bf e underscore three times dot math bf e underscore three. Here, e i Display style math bf e underscore i are the columns of the matrix of the frame and e i display style dot math bf e underscore i their time derivatives. Topic: Components from Euler angles. The components of the angular velocity pseudovector were first calculated by Leonard Euler using his Euler angles and the use of an intermediate frame. One axis of the reference frame, the precession axis. The line of nodes of the moving frame with respect to the reference frame, nutation axis. One axis of the moving frame, the intrinsic rotation axis. Euler proved that the projections of the angular velocity pseudovector on each of these three axes is the derivative of its associated angle, which is equivalent to decomposing the instantaneous rotation into three instantaneous Euler rotations. Therefore, omega equals alpha u one plus beta u two plus gamma u 3 display style bold symbol omega equals dot alpha math bf u underscore 1 plus dot beta math bf u underscore 2 plus dot gamma math bf u underscore 3 this basis is not orthonormal and it is difficult to use but now the velocity vector can be changed to the fixed frame or to the moving frame with just a change of basis for example, changing to the mobile frame omega equals alpha sin beta sin gamma plus beta cos gamma i plus alpha 
sin beta cos gamma minus beta sin gamma j plus alpha cos beta plus gamma k Display style bold symbol omega equals dot alpha sin beta sin gamma plus dot beta cos gamma math bf i plus dot alpha sin beta cos gamma dot beta sin gamma math bf j plus dot alpha cos beta plus dot gamma math bf k, where i j k display style math bf i math bf j math bf k are unit vectors for the frame fixed in the moving body. This example has been made using the ZXZ convention for Euler angles. Topic angular velocity tensor the angular velocity vector omega equals omega x omega y omega z display style bold symbol omega equals omega underscore x omega underscore y omega underscore z defined above may be equivalently expressed as an angular velocity tensor the matrix or linear mapping w equals wt defined by w equals 0 minus omega z omega y omega z 0 minus omega x minus omega y I omega x zero display style w equals begin p matrix zero and omega underscore z and omega underscore y omega underscore z and zero and omega underscore x omega underscore y and omega underscore x and zero n p matrix. This is an infinitesimal rotation matrix. The linear mapping W acts as omega times Display style bold symbol omega times omega times r equals w r display style bold symbol omega times math bf r equals w c d o t math bf r topic calculation from the orientation matrix. A vector R display style math BF R undergoing uniform circular motion around an axis satisfies D R D T equals Omega times R equals W R Display style frac d math bf r d t equals bold symbol omega times math bf r equals w c d o t math bf r. Given the orientation matrix A t of a frame whose columns are the moving orthonormal coordinate vectors e one e two e three. Display style math bf e underscore one math bf e underscore two math bf e underscore three. We can obtain its angular velocity tensor W t as follows. Angular velocity must be the same for the three vectors r equals e i. Display style math bf r equals math bf e underscore i. So arranging the three vector equations into columns of a matrix, we have d a d t equals w a display style frac da d t equals w c d o t a. This holds even if a t does not rotate uniformly. Therefore, the angular velocity tensor is w equals D A D T O minus one equals D A D T A T Display style W equals FRAC da DT C D O T A carrot minus one equals FRAC da DT C D O T A carrot mathem T since the inverse of the orthogonal matrix a display style a is its transpose 
a t display style a caret mathrm t topic properties of angular velocity tensors In general, the angular velocity in an n-dimensional space is the time derivative of the angular displacement tensor, which is a second-rank skew symmetric tensor. This tensor W will have n, n two independent components, which is the dimension of the Lie algebra of the Lie group of rotations of an n-dimensional inner product space. <laughs> Duality with respect to the velocity vector In three dimensions, angular velocity can be represented by a pseudovector because second-rank tensors are dual to pseudovectors in three dimensions. Since the angular velocity tensor W equals W T is a skew symmetric matrix, W equals 0 omega Z minus omega Y minus omega Z 0 omega X omega Y minus omega X 0, display style W equals begin P matrix 0 and omega underscore Z and omega underscore Y omega underscore Z and 0 and omega underscore X omega underscore Y and omega underscore X and 0 end P matrix. It's hard dual is a vector which is precisely the previous angular velocity vector omega equals omega x omega y omega z display style bold symbol omega equals omega underscore x omega underscore y omega underscore z topic exponential of w If we know an initial frame a zero and we are given a constant angular velocity tensor w, we can obtain a t for any given t. Recall the matrix differential equation d a d t equals w a display style frac da d t equals w c d o t a. This equation can be integrated to give a T equals E W T A zero display style A T equals E caret W T a zero, which shows a connection with the Lie group of rotations. Topic W is skew symmetric. We prove that angular velocity tensor is skew symmetric, i.e., W equals D A T D T A T. Display style W equals frac dot T D T C D O T A caret text T satisfies W T equals minus w display style w caret text t equals w a rotation matrix a is orthogonal inverse to its transpose so we have i equals a a t display style i equals a c d o t a caret text t for a equals a T display style a equals a t a frame matrix taking the time derivative of the equation gives zero equals d a d t a t plus a d a t d t Display style zero equals frac da dt a caret text t plus a frac da caret text t dt. Applying the formula a b t equals b t a t. Display style a b caret text t equals b caret text t a caret text t. Zero equals d a d t 
T A T plus D A D T A T T equals W plus W T Display style zero equals FRAC da DT a carrot text T plus left FRAC da DT a carrot text T right carrot text T equals W plus W carrot text T Thus W is the negative of its transpose, which implies it is skew symmetric. Topic Coordinate free description At any instant t display style t the angular velocity tensor represents a linear map between the position vector r t display style math bf r t and the velocity vectors v t display style math bf v t of a point on a rigid body rotating around the origin v equals w r display style math bf v equals w math bf r the relation between this linear map and the angular velocity pseudo vector omega display style omega is the following because w is the derivative of an orthogonal transformation the bilinear form b r s equals W R S display style B math BF R math BF S equals W math BF R C D O T math BF S is skew symmetric. Thus, we can apply the fact of exterior algebra that there is a unique linear form L display style L on lambda two v display style lambda caret 2 v that l r s equals b r s display style l math bf r wedge math bf s equals b math bf r math bf s where r s element of lambda 2 V display style math bf r wedge math bf s in lambda caret two v is the exterior product of r display style math bf r and s display style math bf s. Taking the sharp L sharp of L, we get w r s equals L sharp R S display style W math BF R C D O T math BF S equals L caret sharp C D O T math BF R wedge math BF S introducing Omega equals L sharp display style Omega equals star L caret sharp as the Hodge dual of L sharp, and applying the definition of the Hodge dual twice, supposing that the preferred unit three vector is one. Display style star one. W R S equals L sharp R S equals omega R S equals omega R S equals Omega times R S display style W math BF R C D O T math BF S equals star star L carrot sharp wedge math BF R wedge math BF S equals star Omega wedge math BF R wedge math BF S equals star Omega wedge math BF R C D O T math BF S equals Omega times math BF R C D O T math BF S where Omega 
times r equals omega r display style omega times math bf r equals star omega wedge math bf r by definition because s display style math bf s is an arbitrary vector from non degeneracy of scalar product follows w r equals omega times r display style w math bf r equals omega times math bf r topic angular velocity as a vector field For angular velocity tensor maps positions to velocities, it is a vector field. In particular, this vector field is a killing vector field belonging to an element of the Lie algebra SO of the three-dimensional rotation group SO This element of SO can also be regarded as the angular velocity vector. <laughs> Rigid body considerations The same equations for the angular speed can be obtained reasoning over a rotating rigid body. Here is not assumed that the rigid body rotates around the origin. Instead, it can be supposed rotating around an arbitrary point that is moving with a linear velocity v t in each instant. To obtain the equations, it is convenient to imagine a rigid body attached to the frames and consider a coordinate system that is fixed with respect to the rigid body. Then we will study the coordinate transformations between this coordinate and the fixed laboratory system. As shown in the figure on the right, the lab system's origin is at point O, the rigid body system origin is at O and the vector from O to O is R A particle I in the rigid body is located at point P and the vector position of this particle is Re in the lab frame, and at position Re in the body frame. It is seen that the position of the particle can be written R I equals R plus R I display style math BF R underscore I equals math BF R plus math BF R underscore I the defining characteristic of a rigid body is that the distance between any two points in a rigid body is unchanging in time this means that the length of the vector R I Display style math bf r underscore i is unchanging. By Euler's rotation theorem, we may replace the vector r i display style math bf r underscore i with r r i o display style math call r math bf r underscore i o where r Display style math call R is a three times three rotation matrix and R I O display style math BF R underscore I O is the position of the particle at some fixed point in time, say t equals zero. This replacement is useful because now it is only the rotation matrix R display style math call R that is changing in time and not the reference vector r i o display style math bf r underscore i o as the rigid body rotates about point o also since the three columns of the rotation matrix represent the three versors of a reference frame rotating together with the rigid body any rotation about any axis becomes now visible while the vector r i Display style math bf r underscore i would not rotate if the rotation axis were parallel to it, and hence it would only describe a rotation about an axis perpendicular to it, i.e., it would not see the component of the angular velocity pseudovector parallel to it, and would only allow the computation of the component perpendicular to it. The position of the particle is now written as r i equals r plus R R I O Display style Math BF R underscore I equals Math BF R plus Math call R Math BF R underscore I O 
Taking the time derivative yields the velocity of the particle v i equals v plus d r d t r i o display style math bf v underscore i equals math bf v plus frac d math call r d t math bf r underscore i o where v is the velocity of the particle in the lab frame and v is the velocity of o the origin of the rigid body frame since r display style math call r is a rotation matrix its inverse is its transpose so we substitute I equals R T R display style math call I equals math call R caret text T math call R V I equals V plus D R D T I R I O display style math BF V underscore I equals math BF V plus frac D math call R D T math call I math BF R underscore I O V I equals V plus D R D T R T R R I O display style math BF V underscore I equals math BF V plus frac D math call R D T math call R carrot text T math call R math BF R underscore I O V I equals V plus D R D T R T R I Display style Math BF V underscore I equals Math BF V plus FRAC D Math call R D T Math call R carrot text T Math BF R underscore I or V I equals V plus W R I display style math BF V underscore I equals math BF V plus W math BF R underscore I where W equals D R D T R T display style W equals frac D math call R D T math call R carrot text T is the previous angular velocity tensor. It can be proved that this is a skew symmetric matrix, so we can take its dual to get a three dimensional pseudo vector that is precisely the previous angular velocity vector omega. Display style vec omega omega equals omega x omega y omega z. Display style bold symbol omega equals omega underscore x omega underscore y omega underscore z. Substituting omega for w into the above velocity expression and replacing matrix multiplication by an equivalent cross product. V i equals v plus omega times r i. Display style math bf v underscore i equals math bf v plus bold symbol omega times math bf r underscore i. It can be seen that the velocity of a point in a rigid body can be divided into two terms: the velocity of a reference point fixed in the rigid body plus the cross product term involving the angular velocity of the particle with respect to the reference point. This angular velocity is the spin. Angular velocity of the rigid body as opposed to the angular velocity of the reference point O about the origin O. Topic: 
Consistency We have supposed that the rigid body rotates around an arbitrary point. We should prove that the angular velocity previously defined is independent from the choice of origin, which means that the angular velocity is an intrinsic property of the spinning rigid body. See the graph to the right, the origin of lab frame is O, while O1 and O2 are two fixed points on the rigid body, whose velocity is V 1 display style math bf v underscore 1 and v 2 display style math bf v underscore 2 respectively suppose the angular velocity with respect to o1 and o2 is omega 1 display style bold symbol omega underscore 1 and omega 2 display style bold symbol omega underscore 2 respectively since point p and o2 have only one velocity v 1 plus omega 1 times r 1 equals v 2 plus omega 2 times R two display style math bf v underscore one plus bold symbol omega underscore one times math bf r underscore one equals math bf v underscore two plus bold symbol omega underscore two times math bf r underscore two v two equals v one plus omega one times r equals v 1 plus omega 1 times r 1 minus r 2 Display style Math BF V underscore two equals Math BF V underscore one plus bold symbol Omega underscore one times Math BF R equals Math BF V underscore one plus bold symbol Omega underscore one times Math BF R underscore one Math BF R underscore two The above two yields that Omega one minus Omega two times r 2 equals 0 display style bold symbol omega underscore 1 bold symbol omega underscore 2 times math bf r underscore 2 equals 0 since the point p and thus r 2 display style math bf r underscore 2 is arbitrary it follows that omega 1 equals omega 2 display style bold symbol omega underscore 1 equals bold symbol omega underscore 2 if the reference point is the instantaneous axis of rotation the expression of velocity of a point in the rigid body will have just the angular velocity term this is because the velocity of instantaneous axis of rotation is zero an example of instantaneous axis of rotation is the hinge of a door Another example is the point of contact of a purely rolling spherical or more generally convex rigid body. Topic See also Angular acceleration Angular frequency Angular momentum Aerial velocity Isometry Orthogonal group Rigid body dynamics Vorticity <laughs> <laughs>